So we'll just start with the uh, linear vector. So we make a fist so we get used to it, okay? And my hand is gonna come up above the elbow and I use my anchored elbow just to move this back to my shoulder. I'm gonna go again, outside the elbow, and move it to my shoulder. Outside, and move it to my shoulder. Um, um, all the way to my shoulder. Don't go past your shoulder, you're gonna overextend. Only defend your body. So my hand goes to my shoulder. I want my hand perpendicular to the arm, so I don't wanna do this, okay? So I want as much mass as I can at the deflection angle. So notice how my hand is moving. Um, not here. Turn. Turn, just like katate, right? So my hand, turn, okay? So, um, um. So this is where the Aikido starts to fail because you you actually have a basic but you're not using it as a basic, you're using it as an application. So you would do grab. So I do katata dori, right? So you know here here you have right Idi Minoya, right? Okay. So you see the tension on my arms and the shape of my arms. Okay, and then you go to a uh, ski like in this drill, and now you're doing this, and this this is nowhere in the art. Okay, so what what katata dori is teaching you is a particular body organization where you have structural integrity. At a minimum, let's just take that. It's doing many things, but let's just take that. So when he does his punch. And I go like this, there's nothing there, right? It's not gonna have the impact that you want. So my whole body is organized, right? Everything is organized, okay? And the shapes that my arms take to do the escape, go ahead, is the shape that I use to keep that structural integrity. So when I go here, then move out of the way and push on me, you see? But if I go here, right, and I'm here like this and he pushes on me, you can get out of the way, you can do the drill right there, you see? I have the same thing, same same exact thing right here. You see, of Ikkyo, do you guys see that? So we're doing Ikkyo, boom, and I can move him, and I can't do that if I go like this. You see the difference? I'm bringing him in, okay? So don't screw with the form. That's why we're doing it slow and just static. So boom. If you need to, picture his grip on your wrist and move. Grip on your wrist and escape his wrist. Not like this. You see that difference? Boom. The shape, shape, elbow, boom. Okay, let's go. Ready? Okay. So I have the second hand in now. So if, we, if he's grabbing right and I come in here, the second hand comes in, right? And the second hand again, don't go way past your shoulder. It goes to your shoulder to your shoulder, okay? So I'm going to go for this, one, two. One, two. One, two. It picks up when this space here is on the center line. So when his elbow gets to the center line, that's where that hand is. And that's exactly what I do in these techniques. So I don't go like this, right? Okay, and I don't go like this, right? This hand brings it to the center line. That's the space for it, right? So same thing with just boom. Once I get letting him go by, you see, I'm not stopping him, right? I'm not stopping him. I'm letting him go by. Now, now you have the beginning of Kazushi, okay? So the first one we want to do is we want to just extend the Kazushi out this way. Just 
just to get a feeling of it. So I'm pulling it kind of by letting it go. So, oh, oh. Watch how my body goes around that energy. So I'm not doing anything but keeping it going that way. You see that? I'm not grabbing him. I'm not projecting him. I'm just moving around that elbow point. Okay, so he, he's already losing his balance, right? So here, I'm just going to add to that, right? He was falling, so he go, he's going, you see, he's falling, I'm just going to add to that. You can add to it by taking his leg, you see how I'm doing this? So he's already off balance. So do kite nayo, opening it up, I have the, the, the wrist, right? Boom. And the leg. So oh, he's off balance. Boom. Okay, let's try. Hey, hey. So when I have my uh, fixated movements like katatsatori, um, it looks like I'm doing gross levers and fulcrums, but as you get more advanced, you realize you're working with the forces of the engagement, inertia, gravity, momentum, friction, okay? Well, here, you, you have to rely on that when it's ballistic movement. You cannot rely on fulcrums and levers. It's too fast, okay? But I'm still doing fulcrums and levers of those forces. So as he's coming in, right, me not stopping it and me accelerating it, you see, as I let it go by, all I have to do now is add these little touches at the very end. I'm not going like this. You guys see that? That's a gross motor skill and you're doing tactile, physical levers and fulcrums. So instead he's going, right, I'm moving. So the punch is actually, I'm not flipping it, I'm just keeping it up, do you see? It goes past me, keeping it up, and I attack the leg. You see, it's underhand because it's just a little tap. Boom. Okay, let's go. So, this elbow, as he's as he's coming in, right? I don't want I, it's it's I don't want it to be a matter. Oh, I'm just pulling him. Okay, so we're gonna go. Okay, we're gonna go the other way. So it's still light. Oh, you'll feel it. Oh, oh so he's still off balance. You see that? You feel that? So he's not here, and I go like that. He's off balance, boom, off balance, then I take him. Boom, there, and boom. Boom, let it go, there he goes. Boom, boom. Gets light, and that's when I take it. You'll feel it, off, boom. Okay, try it. Okay. So at, at this range, Right? Um, this can happen, right? Ideally, I should not be, but it can happen, right? And so the more that I'm in this range, the less I'm, I have to, or I will be able to rely on foot maneuvers, okay? My deviation, go ahead, right? My deviation is more my body, you see that? So, whole body. But if I can, uh, as he's punching, right, I'm ready for his intention, meaning I'm not here and I'm reaction, Ooh, okay. right? You're, you're with him. If I can get movement, I will.
okay? If I can't get movement, I gotta move my head off the line, okay? Go. So as you go to standing right, my body's moving, you see? Don't expect your big thing where you're gonna go. You, see, you just need the kazushi. We'll start close. What we don't want is this. You see, no effect on his mass. Okay, we're looking for his mass to go. Some crosses. Boom. Those are round crosses. Okay, try it. So on the crosses, we're closer, right? Let it go past you. Boom. Boom. Let it go past you. Boom. 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 